Hello, 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 everybody. And how is everybody doing today? I hope everybody is doing well. Where I'm at, it's a beautiful day. I think it's still summer, folks. I was out there all day and it feels good, just busy doing stuff. I know I'm just busy, 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 guys. So anyway, right now, guys, I am going to be making one of my favorite juice and it's going to be a juice in the blender i'm using guava and you know guava for us in jamaica is like um one of the best you know aromatic um fruit it's awesome it it's loaded with a lot of vitamin c and i'm going to be using pineapple i have my pineapple and i when i start to smell the pineapple i know it's time to use it and this pineapple smells so awesome i'm going to use that some sweet potato i'm going to be juicing too and um, fresh green merengue and some lime and ginger and folks this one is as they say it's a it's a bummer um, it has anti, anti antioxidant anti-inflammatory this these stuff I'm using right now folks um, they're awesome I make this juice several times and I keep thinking about it folks I just create more, a lot of my own juice I just look and see what the benefits are with all the different fruits and I just put them together so guava having, um, is high in um, antioxidant and um, vitamin C and um, you know sweet potato is a fiber, um, beta carotene and in um, the pineapple the main thing in it is bromelain and that is one of the, the, the stuff that kills cancer you know protect you from cancer. So right now I'm going to peel. See how pretty the pineapple is? Ah awesome. So I just wash it. These are all organic ones. And folks, I might peel it deep, but I still use this part. There's a lot of flesh there, so I, I just like to peel it deep and I'm just get rid of all the eyes and everything one time. People always say to me, why are you, you wasting it? No, 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 this is going to be, a lot of stuff is in this. I'm just going to um, use this later on. Um, so nothing goes to waste. Uh, the pineapple, the smell, the smell, the smell, guys. Ah. Mmm. Folks, it's a sweet one. Yeah, folks, um, we're still in summer here in Canada. I was out there today, and as a lucky thing, I didn't bring a thick coat. Um, I just bring my jacket, and folks, I had to take it off because it was hot and nice. Let me just try to get... Okay, what's going on? Yeah, and I'm loving it, folks. I am just loving it. Okay, so let me just get all of this stuff ready now. My pineapple. The pineapple, you, if you could only smell it, folks, it smells so good. So good. And this is why I buy them when they like, they, the skins are very green. And just let it take the time and um, just right. And even this inner part here, folks, this is where a lot of the... Um, vitamin and uh, the, the brolin, bromelain is in the pineapple so don't throw that out use that also just eat it okay i'm just gonna okay and i'm putting in i'm using my fresh merengue and you know merengue already is um the super food folks it, it lowers your blood sugar but be careful if um if i could lower it too too low so always um check your blood sugar when you um if you're using it on a regular basis because it's it really it's a good thing for if you're a diabetic like i said folks um talk to your doctor but i'm just talking from periods people i know who are diabetic who um use it and the testimony is that it's very good um it lowers the, the blood pressure down right down so that's why you also have to really monitor your blood pressure when you're taking taking it um and that i'm talking about um Merengue. Okay. And you know, with anything you do, and if you know, consult your doctor first and um, hear what he say. But when I tell you anything that it works, it's people who actually, and I try, you know, try a lot of it. And with the mer merengue for sure, folks, I always have to, um, Check my blood sugar at a certain time because um, it really lowers your blood sugar. Yeah. 
So it's good to have a blood glucometer um, to monitor your blood, your blood sugar. And pineapple is very good to drink uh, and the juice is very good to drink, especially at night if you're having like sleeping um, problems because the bromelain is in it is a good um, sedative. And that's one of the main things that doing research I know that they said that can prevent uh, quite a few cancer and they even use it in an um, cancer, a lot of experiment now going on um, with um, pineapple. And also you could boil some water and put the slices of pineapple in it and drink it. And that's a big um, prevention there also. And you do that mostly before you go to bed at night. And that helps a lot. So I'm just doing my... And the sweet potato, they, I, I just use this every day. I don't do a video of it um, every day, but I just juice it every day. And once you juice this folks it just fill up your stomach yeah it has so much fiber in it and so much i think it has more more beta carotene than in um in carrots and it's carola very high in antioxidant and anti-inflammatory and antimicrobial i think yeah it has to present prevent um a lot of um viruses um from entering um your stomach, your gut, and stuff like that. You know, it's um the sweet potato here. This one, and this is the one each. All of them is good, but this one is particularly if you're a diabetic. This one is awesome. Um, and it has, I think, um, lots and lots and lots of um nutrient, vitamin, mineral, and all of that. So this one I'm making right now. It's, it's just. And so also I have the guava here. This is a white guava. Yeah. This is a white one. And you know the been I've been um and this is my merengue here folks and I'm just gonna add in this is washed so I'm using the fresh merengue. You could use the powder too, but I just brought these ones. Um I have these yesterday, so I washed these and um these I'm gonna put to dry to make the powder, but I'm just using a few of it. Yeah, it's when you make the powder and you could buy the empty capsule pills and just put it in and um take your um or you could just put it on top of your porridge or any food you're eating, um sprinkle it over. So but I like to put them in the capsule and um just take them. You know, so they will slowly release um yeah, that's how I take mine. I I just buy these um empty capsule in the drugstore and um just take my meringue and just stick and fill that and every day I take uh, about two weeks away for about two weeks then um because at that time yeah uh, so like I say you have to watch it with um your um your blood sugar it's one of the things that lowers um I'm just gonna put some water in about a cup of water the kettle water it's it's not boiled it's cold I leave it there for a while so it's cold so I also um have some lime I'm gonna put some lime juice lime or lemon but I love I love the taste of lime um in um with certain certain food juice but lemon is also good both of them is good but for certain juice I do, I love limes and um, pineapple is one of them. So I'm just going to, oh, I have the ginger here also. And the ginger, I'm just going to, and it, you could just use a thumb piece, folks. Um, it depends on how much you like, but I love a lot of ginger. I might use more than this piece. You know, I love ginger and garlic. So I just, um. I peel it for this, um, yeah. When I'm doing, I'm um, using the juicer, I, I just put it in, but I peel it for this. And this is Jamaican ginger, it's so strong. I think I'm gonna put another piece in because I love my ginger. How is everybody doing? I hope the folks down in Florida, things are much better. Um, I know a lot of people lost their homes and stuff, so just want to 
send um, some um, thoughts and prayers out to them in Canada too, in the West, in um, the Atlantic provinces, up in um, um, Newfoundland, um, Nova Scotia, I think it's also Prince Edward Island, New Brunswick, I think as far as um, some part of Quebec, they say that it affected, you know, so, so folks in all those provinces, um, saying prayer for you guys and you know, all this too shall pass, okay? So right now I'm gonna, I have some more to put in, but I'm just gonna let this go down first, okay? Um, yeah, I think I'm just gonna make this on. Um, some more water and I don't want to get a end up like a smoothie I want it to be a juice so I'm gonna add some more water to it um, yeah I'm not looking for a smoothie I'm looking for juice 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 so I'm gonna add a little more water to it and um and folks if you want to sweeten it you can put some unpasteurized honey in it if you want um or if you're that diabetic and you want to add your sweetener but I don't take any sweetener. Honey is a nice sweetener if you want to add in it, but I don't want any sweeteners in mine. I no sugar. I'll just drink it like that. But it's optional there if you like to sweeten it up, you know. Feel free. But I, it took me a long time, folks, to drink stuff without sugar. And it feels so good. Like, I still once in a while, if I feel like it, have some sugar, but... um. Even tea, that took me a long time, folks, to um, drink stuff without no sugar, you know? So this is why it just come natural to me now. Uh, it's practice, folks, practice. Yeah, it come natural right now to me um, to just drinking stuff without um, sugar. And I love it because sugar is like the number one. Um, you want to do a lot of baking and stuff, folks. This, folks, I bake them for. I don't really... Um, yeah, I, I used to I used to have such sweet tooth. Um Let's give it a little um strain it so you can if um could drink like this but i drink it so much pulp folks um i'm good right now you know i am so good but uh so i'm gonna maybe i might strain it maybe not i'll just see how thick it is no you gotta get the seeds the seeds out folks this thing is so sweet right now from the pineapple and the sweet potato this doesn't need any sugar oh wow and I'm just gonna add um lemon juice to it. It has to be strained, folks, because of the juice, um, the seeds. You know, uh, because of the seed from the um the guava. So it has to be. And if you are suffering from what you call deeper to, to um, it's a Diva to, to coil or something like that. That's something that for that person you can't have anything with seed in it. So I would recommend if you um have that particular illness, you make sure um it's strained properly. Um because in the water there's lots of seed. So I just have the um the lime that I'm also gonna um, so right now I'm just gonna strain it, okay? Um it tastes so good folks, you, they, they, you put guava and pineapple together and it's awesome. It's awesome. So folks, um, it's a very thick stri um, strainer. Mm, folks, oh my gosh. This guava and this pineapple, the first time I did it, wow. 
Folks, it is so good. And like I said, I don't really want to get it too thick as a smoothie. I want to get it as a juice. And the, 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 the um, sweet potato. Wow, folks. So I'm just going to strain it out now. It's a little slow process here. So folks, I'm going to strain it out and then come back, okay? All right. So guys, welcome back. And the juice is ready. And I strain it. And all you have to do, folks, is put some ice in it. And I had the lime juice to it. And folks, it's to die for. So this is... Um, I didn't have an extra pineapple, folks. So you have to be creative. So I just used my pineapple skin there. Just to show you that's... Um, you know pineapple is in it i i normally have an extra pineapple but i use them so fast so folks um it's sweet potato lime ginger you could use lemon also too and merengue and pineapple and folks it is so, it looks so good in summary i had to put my little umbrella on it and i'm just gonna use my straw and folks um let me tell you it tastes awesome so okay here we go Hmm, folks, this is a nice summery juice. So it's guava, lime, merengue, and sweet potato, and pineapple. And folks, just strain it properly because the guava have a lot of seeds in it, okay? So folks, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And big up Fire in Jammy Hood. And big up Marie and Mello down in... um. Florida, big up yourself, Deacon. He's the hardest working man in Jamaica right now. Okay, so folks, go over and um, subscribe to um, Jamie Wood if you want um, to show fire some support. And um, um, Soji and Liz, okay, um, Richard Brown and their friends too, everybody. So big up yourself, folks. Um, try this. This is loaded with everything anti in it, folks. Nothing, um, thing. Everything is anti. It is so good. Give it a shot. And Jules Charles, big up yourself. Also, um, she's one of my supporters, too, one of my subscribers. And so, big up yourself, Jules. And everybody else, Ivelyn, all of you guys, um, have a wonderful day. Okay? Peace.